Day 13, 1992, Yamaha Virago XV1100. So today we just put the bike together. Kind of wanted to see what it looked like. We still got some par waiting on some parts and things, and I'll show you those in a minute. But we just wanted to get it together. The epoxy, uh, you know, dried out on the uh, the primary and the sub tanks from yesterday. So it just seemed like you know, get it together. We're not gonna put any fuel in it for a while. We're gonna wait several days for that. Um, you know, no rush on getting that done. But here's a look at the few little odds and ends we got left. Good looking bike overall. You know, uh, considering what we've got in it, you know, the labor. We, we put a little over 40 hours in it at this point and uh but parts and and money wise we've done well uh i want to bleed the brakes one more time They're just a little that's a little soft uh, i don't i don't like a full pull on that um got to install the uh, the pull and push cable for the throttle and then that right side choke kit has got to be installed the hazard lights uh, aren't working. I don't know if that's the switch or relay, but we'll run that down. The uh, the tab is broken on this right side cover, the upper tab. Um, I've got that in there um, being epoxied up right now. Uh, I think we're going to be able to save that. You know, other than that, just, just a good detail on it. Uh, I say, good looking bike. I think we're just going to ride it for a while and uh, enjoy it. So there's day 13, you know, we're gonna ride it for a little bit. Uh, once once the uh, tanks settle in a little bit, maybe next week we'll put some gas in it, put some miles on it, and then uh, we'll either sell it as is, as a, a good budget for somebody, kind of a low budget intro bike, or uh, we've got some paint laying around. We've got some uh, dark metallic blue laying around that uh, we may paint the tins with. We'll just wait and see.